Hi guys, welcome back to the vlogs. It feels weird because I haven't vlogged in mm, probably like a month since I've been home from Europe. Anyway, welcome back to the vlogs. If you guys are wondering where I am right now, I'm currently in my Noosa home. I explained this in a recent vlog, but I'm basically staying in Noosa for a few months until I find my Sydney apartment. So that's where I am right now. I have so many life updates to give you guys, but I will do them a bit later in the video. I just got home from Pilates, so I'm gonna shower, get changed, get dressed for the day. I also chopped all my hair off. I don't know if you guys can tell, but my hair is finally in such a good, healthy place. Like it's so strong and I'm just so happy with how, with how it's going. I did also get myself an oat latte this morning. So I'm gonna finish this go for a shower and then get myself ready and we can spend the day together in Noosa. Just finished getting ready for the day. This is the glam. I, mean, I desperately need another coffee. I feel like I'm so tired. I haven't been really working out a lot since obviously being in Europe and then also not being able to work out because of my surgery. So today's Pilates class took it out of me. Before I get dressed though, because I'm currently in <laughs> my pajamas, I've been living in these shorts. I got these when I was in Paris and I honestly don't think I've taken them off. They're just so comfy and cute. And this little baby yellow tee because I'm trying to wear stuff that covers my really ugly bandage. So gotta get changed though into something else today. Um, but I wanted to talk to you guys about my hair because I am finally in such a happy place with it. And if you guys have followed me for a while, you would know that I went through that whole like extension phase and I was scalp bleaching it. Like I do a lot to my hair. My hair goes through some serious hardship and it just goes through a lot. So my breakage was pretty bad and it was super damaged. Um, but I don't know if you guys can tell, but it's finally in a really healthy place now because I've actually been looking after it. I discovered the Kerastas Genesis collection and basically this whole collection is to prevent hair fallout. So this is the shampoo that I use, which like I said, prevents hair fallout. And then there's also a washout hair mask which is this one here. I love, love the hair mask. I also have the Kerastase Genesis Serum. I think the serum is probably my favorite because you can use it on wet or dry hair. So what I like to do is in the shower, I use the shampoo, conditioner, mask. And then when I get out, I towel dry my hair and then I like to apply the serum. Or you can also put it onto dry hair, which is also something that I like to do because if I haven't washed my hair, I can still apply the serum every single day. You're meant to use it morning and night. I've been using this religiously. It's my second bottle. It's also a silicone free formula and it strengthens from the root, which I think is probably the biggest reason that I've noticed my hair feels stronger because it doesn't just do it at the end. I used to also get a lot of, uh, what are they called? Like flyaways because my hair was damaged and the ends would snap off. I feel like my flyaways are definitely less prominent now. I'll leave links in the description box down below if you guys want to try it out for yourself. Yeah, I'm so happy with how my hair is finally growing and I'm also really glad that I chopped it as well because now that it's healthy, the ends just feel so much better. That's enough about my hair. I am going to get myself dressed and ready for the day. I actually have no idea what I feel like wearing. It's been pretty warm and it's like, it's such a nice day today so I think it's going to be pretty hot. So, I don't know, I have this like cute little green set. That could be nice, but I'm going to try some outfits on. I'll show you guys whatever I do decide to end up wearing before I leave. I also have this top. Oh god, that just hit me in the face. I don't know. I'll let you know whatever I decide to wear. I had a PR delivery this morning. So, I think I'm going to wear one of the lipsticks that is in here. This one here. This is from Anastasia Beverly Hills. And this is the shade... My camera doesn't want to focus, but it's the shade Warm Taupe. It looks like a really nice nude. There's some other fun things in here too. Foundation, there's a lip gloss. So I'm excited to play around with this, but I'm going to use this one for today. There's nowhere really I can stand and show you guys my outfit of the day. It's kind of hard because obviously I haven't lived here in so long. So my parents redid my whole room. Um, it's like a guest bedroom now, so there's no longer really a full-length mirror or anywhere where I can show you guys my like outfits, but maybe I'm gonna have to go to Ikea and buy like one of those um, like basic full-length mirrors. I'm wearing this black dress from White Fox. It's like an off-the-shoulder moment, and I think, I think I'm supposed to wear it this way, but obviously when I put it on this side, this whole 
big ugly bandage <laughs> it's like right right in your face so i'm trying to wear it the other way but it's a little bit too big so we're gonna try and make it work and then i've just got black slides on and my celine sunglasses that i got for europe i love them so much i actually got a few questions about these i think over on my i don't know if it was my i don't know if it was my tiktok or my youtube but um yeah, some of you guys were asking where these are from and they are from Celine. Maybe we're gonna head off now. Go meet my girlfriend Maddie, not the one that's getting married. A another one of my friends called Maddie. I think I have like four friends that are called Maddie, which is just seems a little bit ridiculous, doesn't it? Alright, off we go. It is such a nice day today. Wow. Wow! I can't even express to you guys how excited I am to not have to wear this white bandage all the time because it is just so aggressive sorry it's so dark it is just so aggressive and I know I'm being smart by wearing it obviously I don't want keloids on my chest but man look at that that is just a harsh reminder I hope everyone that is watching this takes this as a reminder to please 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 wear sunscreen because this, if I didn't actually, or actually not just obviously wear sunscreen, but also go get skin checks because this, um, this was fine because I got it early, but you don't want to end up like me and have to be wearing a bandage or something worse because you didn't wear sunscreen and didn't go get skin checks. So take it from me folks, get your skin checked. Just arrived at my destination. I'm just going to put on a little bit of perfume. And then we can head in. I also need to put on that lipstick and show you guys what it looks like. I'm using these little like perfume drops. They're so good. They're little like gel capsules. I did put on a little bit of lipstick before I left the house, but let's put some more on. Sometimes struggle to find nice neutral shades with my skin tone because I am so fair that lipsticks look really dark on me. Mads and I are gonna do a little bit of window shopping. Mm -hmm. This cream set's cute. Like that. Look at the that's so cute. Cook I just has such good basics. Oh green one. An outfit shock because I couldn't show you guys before, but this is the LBD that I'm wearing on the wrong side, I think. My cute afternoon date. You guys remember Maddie. When was the last time you were on the vlog? Maybe like Christmas? Oh, uh, yes. Yeah, Christmas? So stunning. I also sat down off my ledge because I was so high and we stole a chair from here. So hopefully, we don't want that back. But we're just having such a nice afternoon. I'm home now back from my little outing this afternoon and it's about 5 p.m. the sun is setting and it's really pretty I love this time of day in Noosa I feel like it's just it's bringing me Europe vibes home from Pilates this morning and I got myself another coffee I have to do a little bit of work today but I if I get everything done, I might go to the beach this afternoon. I just got out of the shower. Excuse the bandage. It's so aggressive and I can't, I'm not allowed to actually change the tape for another like a week or so I think. Yeah, so please ignore that. But anyways, I'm just putting in a little bit of the Kerastase, Kerastase Fortifying Serum. I'm gonna work it from the root to the tip of my hair, do some skincare and a little bit of glam and get myself ready for the day. I've been listening to Leo Skeppi's podcast, Aware and Aggravated. It is so good. I am just trying to figure out what to wear, but I do have a few more work things that I have to do. I have to film a, another YouTube video and I actually am going to start editing this one. I want to get it up because I haven't posted a real-time vlog in so long. So I'm gonna get started on that, but I think I'm gonna wrap this video up here because I'm just gonna be sat, I'm just gonna be sat on my laptop for the rest of the day editing, which is not very exciting for you guys to watch. But I hope you have enjoyed the first of many Noosa Day in My Life videos. I wanna do like a weekend in my life here. Um, and yeah, I've got a few video ideas that I think will be fun for while I'm here. I'm also so excited for the like apartment hunting vlogs to come and then when I do find a place for all of the moving vlogs to come as well because I think that's going to be really really fun and I'm very excited for that 
chapter hope you guys have enjoyed this video and if you also have any other video suggest suggestions that you guys would like to see whilst i'm here please just comment them because i obviously have a lot more free time being in noosa since i'm not really like going to any event if you guys have any videos that you do want to see i can definitely film that. yeah thank you guys for watching and i will see you in my next youtube video Mwah.